Greetings and welcome, my fellow viewers. I am Rebecca the Collector Dragon, and today I start the Positively Unstoppable Challenge by DDP Yoga and the chance to win a million dollars. And even if I don't win, I'll have the victory of changing my life forever. Wish me luck. Um, I'm going to be showing every day, every day for this challenge. I'm going to be uploading videos of my progress. Some of them might be good. Some of them might be bad. I don't know. Hopefully everyone, every single one will be a positive change. So for today, I'm going to be cutting to my video. I'm going to cut to my web screen. It's going to look terrible because I don't have proper editing and proper um, anything like not the best video content creator, okay? I admit that. But that's okay because everything will change after the end of, by the end of this challenge because I will succeed no matter what. Um just to iterate my goals here, they are I want to breathe better. I want to break this laziness that I've lived for far too long. I want to be stronger both mentally and physically. I want to have more stamina and drive, and most importantly, I want to be happy and no longer depressed and anxious for just being who I am, I guess. And I just don't, I no longer want to be a typical high-functioning autistic person that can never finish his goals. That's probably the biggest one of them all. So without further ado, here's to a whole new life. So a little background on myself and um, my workout history. Uh, I used to do martial arts when I was nine years old. I started when I was nine years old and I used to be very well fit and very well active and I got my black belt uh, just before I turned 12. So basically three years. Um, Unfortunately, that kind of slid off to not doing it as much as I wanted to. Things kind of changed for my life, and I wasn't able to continue as much as I had wanted. Um, uh, currently, I've been working with East Coast Combative Arts, who's a, where we do fight choreography, and basically we write, train, and perform fight act, fight acting performances like you would see in movies, theater, or, you know, at fairs, independent acts, you know, even birthday parties maybe. <laughs> we do all kinds of catering. We do all kinds of stuff. And we do teach, both teaching for real fighting and for stage fighting. Um, and we try to be as historically accurate while still being a little flourishing. Uh... I've been basically that's been a side job though. My main job is just I work retail, and uh, I and the and I do front end stuff, which can include getting retrieving cards, doing bottle removal, um, bagging for people, getting stuff off shelves, putting stuff in cars, all kinds of pretty active but not rigorous. You know, well, it is rigorous for me sometimes, but I'm not as strong as I used to be, so. It's kind of sometimes it's emotionally painful. Um, currently, and I also about a year ago or so, I don't remember, maybe two years ago, I started DDP yoga to try and improve my life that way, and I was really heavily motivated. And then, like everything else, it just kind of died. So, through this challenge, I'm hoping that I can improve and no longer have that problem. <laughs> That's the hope. Um, I also bought a whole crap ton of stuff to help me improve. I've got um, official, like the best yoga mats you can buy. I just resubscribed to DDP Yoga now, the online app, um, which is currently currently on sale for thirty percent off for the year subscription. So that's wonderful. Uh, definitely saved a lot of money there. And I also have um, the heart rate monitor that DDP Yoga provides, and I also got uh, some health mate stuff like. Um, I think it's called the Nokia uh, fitness scale or something. It's it, 
does a lot of stuff. It, I'm sure you'll see it because I'm going to show it off in videos. And for those of you who can identify it, you'll certainly know what it is. <laughs> um, basically, it weighs everything from your from your weight to your bone mass to heart rate and all kinds of stuff. So, so I'm going to be stepping onto my scale here. It is currently 4:30 ish at night. This will not be when I'm weighing myself every day. So. Um, so there probably will be a significant difference. I don't know if I'm going to be showing off my weight every day, um, maybe at least once a week. Um, but I wanted to do catalog this one in particular because it's the first one. It's the most important and stuff like that. All right. So first of all, kind of, kind of step on it. Uh, let's see. Can we see it? Okay. It says 225 pounds. Let's try zooming in. Yep, there we go. 225.8. I've gained five and a half pounds since I last measured myself. It wasn't able to calculate my heart rate for some reason. I don't know. Doesn't matter. 7.9 pounds in bones. 172.9 in muscle. 32.4 BMI. Looks like it's high. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what BMI really means. Anyway, back to me, I guess. <laughs> oh, one last thing for anyone who would care. I don't know if anyone would care, but... I feel like sharing it. Um, pretty much all of this is going to be recorded off of my Razer 2 phone. That's Razer, the phone comp the gaming company that makes all kinds of computer accessories and whatnot. So, you know, if you are interested in buying one of their stuff, I do have the Razer 1 phone too, but um, let's just say it hasn't been the most glorious of prototype phones. And this one's like a final product phone, and it's really amazing and great, and I love it. Uh, more so than the first one. <laughs> I loved the first one when I first got it, but over time, um, just stuff happened. And so I kind of had to get the second one, and it's infinitely better. And so if anyone's interested in getting one of those, this, this is a pretty good... You can see how good the quality of the video is. So you'll know at least know how good the camera is. <laughs> so, so yeah, I was really motivated and determined to do... To do much better than I have, and hopefully, hopefully things will change from here on out. Um, thank you, thanks to anyone who is willing to follow me through this journey. Win or lose, it's about owning my life, and I can't thank DDP enough for that.